cute, identical twins prank teacher in cutest way. If there was ever a story which proves that prejudice is learned, this is it. This is such a cute tale of perfect innocence as we meet two best friends who get their hair cut so that they'll look exactly the same. First of all, I just want to say thank you for all your comments. We don't have time to reply to them all, but we do read them, so keep them coming. Thanks again to Noreen for her comment on our story of the pensioners who escaped the care home to go to a heavy metal festival. God bless these wonderful people for showing us it's never too late to fulfil your dreams. Quite right, Noreen. Hufflepuff Potato said they definitely made the right decision. I agree, my friend. Yes, indeed. So back to today's story. This originally came to light back in 2017 on the Love What Matters Facebook page, published by Lydia Stith Rosebush, and it immediately went viral. And if that sounds out of date, wait to the end as there's a little update for you. So the story goes that best friends Jackson Reddy are absolutely convinced that they look identical. Now to a cynical adult, there may be one thing which immediately jumps out at us, but not to these two boys. And if you look a little closer at the two of them as five-year-olds, you can see why. If you see past the skin colour, these boys do actually look remarkably similar. Well, these unprejudiced young men certainly looked past the skin colour. They didn't seem to see it at all as they embarked on an excellent prank to confuse their teacher. You see, as far as they could tell, the one thing that gave away who was who was that Jax's hair stood up while Reddy's was cropped short. That's when they came up with their cunning plan. If Jax cropped his hair like Reddy's, how on earth would their teacher be able to tell them apart? According to Jax's mum Lydia, he couldn't wait to get to school on Monday to see the teacher's face as she tried to work out who was who. Mum Lydia wrote on her Facebook page that this is proof that prejudice is learned. What else could it mean? The only difference these two five-year-olds saw in each other was the style of their hair. Beautiful. As we said, this lovely story got a lot of attention back in 2017, with loads of people writing in and sharing other examples of kids who just don't naturally think in prejudiced terms. There was a teacher from Germany, for example, who commented that she had asked her class how many refugees they had in the room and was surprised and delighted by the answer from the children that there were no refugees, only kids. Brilliant. Quite profound. From the mouths of babes, eh? Now, I said there was a little update, didn't I? I wonder sometimes if these stories are blown out of proportion a bit or if there's some urban myth involved, but we were so pleased to discover that Jax and Reddy are still BFFs as the more recent photos show. Sometimes the innocence of a child is more than simple ignorance, isn't it? It's just plain old common sense that exists before the cynical and prejudiced world fills our minds with rubbish. We really can learn something valuable from these two. Like what? Well, just love each other. Let us know in the comments below if you have any stories like this. And don't forget to share this bit of hope for the future with your friends and family.